Good morning, everyone. We are going to the camera store today um, in West Hollywood because, oh, if I have a list, it's because of my Invisalign. Um, but I need to get a new camera because this camera has served me very well, but the autofocus is getting so bad on this thing that I, it's just time for an upgrade. I've had this camera for like almost five years, so it's just time for an upgrade. And I would buy it online, but I don't really like buying like expensive things or like electronics online because I'm like, I don't know, I get super anxious about like shipping and things like that. Like I don't want it to get damaged. I don't want someone to steal it. I don't want it get to lo I don't want it to get lost. So um, we're just gonna go to the camera store real quick and buy a new camera. I'm planning on getting the Sony ZV-1. Um, it's marketed as like a, a vlogging camera. Um, so I'm really excited to like try it out in person and um, hopefully get it today. So, ciao! I have some amazing news, you guys. Um, I got approved for the apartment. Do that again. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so happy. We waited so long for this approval, but it finally happened. I'm so excited. Um, and I got my camera. I got a new uh, monopod for my camera. Oh, we just were new home, new equipment. Girl, woo! And I'm celebrating with some sushi. <laughs> My camera is charging. Um, it's really cool because you can use the camera while it's charging, but we've got a new camera, girls! <laughs> My mom's watching a K-drama. She does not care about what I'm doing right now. Tell me what's your motive, motive. What's your motive? What's your motive? What's your motive? Ah, ah, ah. Baby, tell me what's your motive? motive. What, what's your motive? What's your motive? What's your motive? What's your motive? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so we are vlogging on the new camera girls. Um, and we're going to Target right now because I need to get a couple of things for the new apartment, like, you know, toilet paper and uh, paper towels. But also, my brother went to the emergency room on Monday and he had to get like an emergency surgery and we just found out about it like yesterday or like two days ago. Um, so we are going to get some things for like a care package and kind of drop it off to him. So let's get going. Wow, I'm gonna man. Look, my mom's so pretty. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, God, what a madhouse. There were way too many damn people in there. Wow, look at the low light on this camera. And the skin tone looks really nice. If this is on my other camera, it's gonna be red. Yeah, I just need to like, kind of sit here for a second. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Today, my mom and I are going to my dad's house. Um, we are going to clean out my bedroom over there. Um, you'll get to see my bedroom from when I was a teenager. When I moved out of the house, back in 20 like the beginning of 2018 um i kind of just like took what i needed and left everything else there and my dad was like can you come like clean out your stuff so i can use this bedroom like as an extra bedroom or like bedrooms for guests and i was like okay so we're gonna go over there today and clean out my bedroom but also um i want to donate all the clothes that are already there um there's like a, a an organization doing a clothing drive 
um, in East LA tomorrow. And so I want to go pick up some clothes and donate them because, you know, it's better to like, they're just sitting there. So it's better to like give them to, you know, someone who needs it more than, you know, my room. <laughs> um, so we're going to do that. Also, my dad's Christmas gift came in or the gift that I'm going to give to my, um, for my, to my dad. Back in like, I don't know, 2012 or something like that, like years ago um, for Christmas, we got him a pair of Jordans and he has used them to like its death. The um, sole came off and he tried to glue it back together. I was like, no, sir, we're getting you a new pair of shoes. So I got him some black and white Air Force Ones wanted to get him these ones because they're very versatile. I didn't want to get him the white ones because he doesn't keep his sneakers clean. <laughs> so um, I wanted to get like a black and white one. Oh, they look so good. I hope he likes them. What do you guys think of my hair? I saw this in a TikTok. It was like a TikTok, like short hair ideas. It kind of doesn't make sense, but it's also kind of cute. What do y'all think? What do you think, mom? It's cute. Also, I just want to show you guys um, the care package that we got from my brother at Target. So we got him a heating pad. I also got myself one. I used it yesterday. What was life before heating pads? Wow. Would highly recommend. <laughs> um, we also got him like this really cute um, like pajama set. And then this is my favorite um, drugstore body lotion other than the CeraVe one. This is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Body Gel Cream. We got him some Altoids. You know, just mints to keep fresh. And then we also got him a pair of like these thick socks. So that is our little care package for my brother. I hope you enjoy it, Guya. Hi. Hi, Hi. Thank you for taking care oh, of yeah. your He's big fine. boy. He's doing fine. He's thing. good. Yay. <laughs> oh, hi, kitty. I always forget that. Hello. Yes, yeah. Yes, yeah. Woo! No one surprised. Dad is watching another science documentary. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Y'all, look blinded. at look oh at this god. place. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what? <Ta> -da! <laughs> yeah, so basically we are just going to uh go through everything, I guess, and uh, see what happens. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys, I don't know if, like, I don't know how many of you have been following me since, like, 2017, but in the, the first time I went to um, VidCon, I did, like, a little um, hijab demonstration with Aisha, and this is the, this is the hijab tr that she used on me. I have to make sure to keep this. This was very special to me. <laughs> Aisha, if you're watching, look! So, uh, back when I was doing background work, like, when I was an extra in mo in movies and TV shows, I like way before I started acting, um, you had to bring your own wardrobe to those things sometimes. Well, actually all the time. You had to always bring your own wardrobe. And sometimes they would ask you to bring a backpack because I played high school students a lot. And you're not allowed to have any logos. So this actually says Jansport because it's a <clears throat> Jansport backpack. But I think when I was filming, I think it was Pretty Little Liars. Um, I brought this and they put this black tape over it so you can't see the Jansport and ever since I just left it on there because every single time you film they're gonna cover it with black tape anyway so I just thought that was a fun little story. <laughs> oh. All right y'all we are basically done here we basically just need to like pack everything up and then put it in the car. I remember how this happened so I had a smoothie in my backpack and it exploded and that's the story of that. <laughs> I even had the carpet clean. He said he couldn't get it out. Is that true? That's true. What, what happened? True then? story. I, I had a smoothie in my backpack and it exploded. <sighs> <laughs> All right, we're about to go pick up some food and then we will, after we eat, we'll get back to work. Woohoo, Black Bear Diner. Oh, it smells so good. I can't wait. I'm like so over Asian food right now. I want some good old 
American comfort food. <laughs> Even though I got fish and chips, which is not American. But anyway. Look at this burger, y'all. Look how big that is. I don't even know if you can tell how big that is. Look, okay, that's her hand for reference. Look how huge <laughs> that is. <laughs> Inmate 34667, please follow Marshall. Where is she taking me? Inmate 34667, you have three seconds to comply with your new directive. On the way to Goodwill. All right, so this is the situation. We're about to go um, drop all these things off. So we have this that we're dropping off today over in East LA. We also have all of this. We have to like resort through everything because some of these things are going to Goodwill. Some of these things we're actually keeping and some of these things we're sending to the Philippines. So we have to like sort through all of these again, but very happy with the progress we're making. We love that. All right, so I forgot to vlog us actually handing over the items, but I guess it's not really that necessary, but we just dropped everything off. Um, you guys can follow the People's Bodega on Instagram. Um, they are um, the organization, like the group that's um, doing these donations. And if you know of anyone in the LA area who, who is in need of clothing in LA or like the East LA area, um, I will leave you can check their Instagram, but I'll also leave some information right here. Um, so they are doing like a, a donation, I mean, a, a clothing drive, and they also have like some food and things like that. So if you know of anyone in the LA area who is in need of something like that, be sure to tell them to check that out. And another thing that's also cute <coughs> is that they gave us a little flower. <coughs> it's like a little appreciation. I need <coughs> Uh, I'm back. <coughs> they gave us a little flower as a token of appreciation. Um, and that's all I wanted to say. All right, bye. <coughs> yep. <clears throat> I've tried. I forgot my line. Damn it. Oh, okay. So I just finished a very emotional self tape. Like, every single scene was super emotional. Usually when you do a self tape and there's like an emotional scene, they usually like balance it out with two scenes or like one scene that's not very emotional, but this one was emotional for every single scene. So I'm like kind of exhausted. Uh, got my ring light here, but now um, we're going to move on with the day. So we are going to pick up some more PR packages and then we're going to get some um, food. I'm kind of craving like a fried chicken sandwich. <laughs> which is probably not good for my stomach, um, but I'm craving it, so I'm gonna get it. And then my mom is like weirdly craving like kettle chips. I think she's addicted. I think she has an, addic an addiction because she was like, she needs to have them. <laughs> so we're gonna do that right now. And then when we come back, we're going to declutter the apartment and kind of like prep for the move. I pick up my keys tomorrow, um, so I'm like very excited about that. Um, so yeah, let's get started. All of this stuff, except for my bed, is basically going to be sold. But anyway, all right, let's get going. <laughs> also, look at mom's outfit today. Come on, mom. All right, let's, ooh. So we've got a, a <laughs> we've got a Fila uh, t-shirt, uh, red, navy blue and white and then we've got a red puffer coat <laughs> navy blue like velour <laughs> sweatpants with a stripe on the side and then she got her air force ones on she's kind of wearing a lot of brands because she's wearing fila puma and nike but it's okay because you look cute and then for me i'm just wearing a sweatshirt sweatpants and my air force ones because i don't feel like dressing up today all right let's go girls um we're at chick-fil-a right now because chick-fil-a is right next to whole foods um, and it's a madhouse over here. 
Been waiting here for about 10 minutes. I mean, it's the lunch rush, but come on, man. We have secured the food and my mom's tired, so we're not going to Whole Foods anymore. <laughs> I'm hungry, let's eat. Is this even real chicken? Why is it good? Oh. No, literally just like dip it in here like this. No. Mmm. And chicken is tasty. I told you every single chicken sandwich I've had you try it was good. I don't know why you think chicken sandwiches are dry. We're watching Cobra Kai. If you guys have seen um, Karate Kid, it's basically like a spin-off of it. It's supposed to be like 30 years into the future. At first I was like, this looks corny. Like, I don't know, I thought it was like kind of corny, like based on the ads that I saw, but we watched it and it's so good. It's actually really, really good. Yeah. It's, it's very like, um, there's a story to it. Yeah, and it's very nuanced. It's not like your typical like bad guy, good guy story. It's like very nuanced and like, I don't know. Okay. It's really character good. Character development. Yeah, there's a lot of character development. There's like a redemption arc. It's like really, really good. So you guys should check it out on Netflix. All right, so a little bit of an update. We kind of got carried away with Cobra Kai, so we didn't um, declutter anything. <laughs> But we have so much time to do that because, um, you know, we don't have to move out of this apartment for like another two months. So I think I'm going to end the vlog here. We're just going to finish up some Cobra Kai. And in the next vlog, that's when we'll start decluttering stuff. We'll just do that in another vlog. All right. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.